So, so where are we going, Kayla? Uh, we're gonna get some bagels. I can't say that word. Don't make me say it on camera. <laughs> you can't say bagels? No, no, bagels, 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 uh, bagels. Bagel? And then what? And then we're gonna go to Dayton Farmers Market, and we're going to uh, visit some Mennonite families. Mennonite. And what's a Mennonite? Oh my gosh. Oh my god. The robots are <laughs> winning. <laughs> While we were at James Madison University, we met a really interesting professor. I made kind of like a wacky comment about how it's easier to saw through bamboo than it is to saw through oak. And that kind of kicked off a conversation about something that he thinks about a lot, has to do with leadership and this kind of thing. Strain, all you're looking at is the length. The change in length from the initial state to the finished state. Okay, so that's your strain. Your stress is a area. So how much force can you receive per your area? Vigil. With oak, what it's basically saying is that you can take a lot of stress, but when you get to a certain point, you're gonna snap. Uh. Boo, under high winds, high pressure, high systems, it's gonna sway in the wind should be asking is not strength, it's toughness. Uh. Be about, it's not about how much you can take. So after touring around James Madison University for a bit, we headed out to the country to visit some Mennonites and to check out Fort Harrison. This is a little strange for okay. this, uh, this, this museum, this house. But this is an exhibit that a family asked us to put here. There was a lady who lived out at Dry River, which is out behind Bridgewater, yeah. um, on a farm, early 1900s. She was a little girl, and she was riding around. They had a grain press, and the oh, horses no. were pressing the grain and going around in a circle, and she got up on the top of it. I kind of visualized like an old-fashioned merry-go-round. Mm -hmm. Her leg got caught. And it pulled her leg off. It it, it, it basically Gosh. separated her but leg. She survived. She yes. survived. And this is all the doctor's records and everything. And they had she had a prosthesis. They took her up to Washington, and the same company that does a lot of prosthesis for um, like um, uh, you know soldiers coming back, they still have a company that manufactures these. Wow. So her father took her up there and had her leg made for. Her. She was about four when it happened, and she lived to be in her 80s. She died not too wow. long ago. So these are all um, places where you can hitch your hitch your buggies up your buggy. when you go to church on Sunday, right? Uh, she had this huge show at Rockefeller Center in 2003. If you've ever seen the Christmas tree, mm -hmm. yes. So, no, oh, okay. Christmas tree came down, <laughs> yeah. and they commissioned her to put her art 
189 pieces. Oh, wow. 189 pieces. Of her pieces. Of all, the, all different kinds. It took her six months. And so the tree came down and she put her pieces on the walls, actually garden, and then suspended from one wall to another. Wow. And uh, so 189 pieces. No woman has ever done that at Rockefeller Center. Today's show, right around the corner. Right around the corner, yeah. NBC. Oh, absolutely. I'm gonna go over there. It's a no-brainer. Absolutely. I'll have the producer come over, meet you. He'll be fascinated with your life, your story, the art, because this is winter now, and to have this with the snow yeah. and all the colors. I said, I know that the camera, they'll bring a remote camera over, Absolutely. and they'll interview you, they'll show all the artwork. Well, if you knew my mother, she did not believe in self-promotion. Oh, man. Because she's from the 40s. Oh, and wow. artists don't do those things. So she says, Gary, don't you dare. Uh, I she did it anyway. I, uh, no, I man. learned my lesson. Oh, After man. that, and I'm telling you youngsters, <laughs> don't ask for permission. Yes, yeah, forgiveness. Always ask for forgiveness. <laughs> yes. Because if you ask for permission, it's no. Yes. It's yeah. no. So I asked her for permission. Mom, I'm going to go over there. I should have just gone over there yeah. Yeah. and come over and then brought it back.